Hey guys, today I have a spring haul for you, so I was going to do a lookbook and I still might. Let me know if you want to see some of these outfits put together in a lookbook and I can try to do that this weekend. It's just hard during the week with the sun setting by the time I get home and stuff. So anyways, I'm just going to get into it. This is kind of a collective haul. So I got three things from lulus.com and I have a 15% off like discount code for lulus.com. It's spread in sunshine. I'll put all the information you need to know down below because I know it could be hard to remember. But it's all capital and it's 15% off, so that's great. And on another note, I'm just going to show you what I got. So first, I got this peach commuter train dress. And it is gorgeous. I've already worn it, so I'm like digging stuff out of my dirty clothes. So it's kind of gross. I'm just kidding. But um, anyways, so it's this really pretty peach color. And then this thing is super in lately. Like, I don't know what you would call this. Like, a tie in the front? But... It's really in. I love the way it looks. It kind of dresses up the outfit a lot. It makes it more mature, I think. And then it's just, you know, a peach dress. Then I got this Second Nature white dress, and it is gorgeous. So I'm going to show you guys. So the front actually looks really, really simple and basic. And for some reason, the front, I don't know if you guys are going to see this right here where it's bunched. It kind of fits me weird. I'm not sure why. Why? I think I need to like belt it or something. But it is the back like holy cow. I'm gonna link all these down below so you can see them like on a model or something because they're gorgeous and the bottom's like super frilly. I don't... Ah! So it has like really pretty kind of ruffled bottom but now the back oh my goodness. The back is open and it has these two straps like this and let me like hang this on my arm and then this comes around and ties in the back so it kind of crisscrosses with it it's absolutely gorgeous and the last thing I got from there is this what's up doc handbag and it's in the color ivory so it's pretty much white and I've been using it every day for school so it's kind of heavy to pick up but it's this bag and I love it because I don't have I've been wanting an ivory handbag for such a long time and I have a black one that I love, my Michael Kors one that I saved up for. But this one, I feel it's better for spring because I feel like if I, of course I can wear black in the spring, but it's not very like bright and shiny. And this will match absolutely everything. Like I said, I've been carrying it to school and it latches in the front and sometimes I get lazy and just kind of throw it over. But what's great about this is the opening, it interlaps with each other so you could just kind of close it like that and it like stays in place and doesn't fall. And what's great about that is you don't have to just leave your bag open and everybody could just like see in it and grab in it and this and that. Then I went to Target with my aunt and she got me some stuff for my birthday. So this bathing suit top, I love the top of it. Target has such cute bathing suits for such a great deal. So it's like this and I didn't get the bottoms because they're just plain black and I have plain black, plain black bottoms. And black bottoms. Try saying that three times fast. She also got me these adorable coral flip-flop sandals kind of thing. They're downstairs and I left them. They're just, I don't want to go downstairs and get them. But they're a really pretty just coral and it has like a silver shiny ring with like rhinestones. They're so, so cute. And then I got some nail polishes. And oh my gosh, you guys, I'm obsessed with the Hunger Games, but I'm not one of those people who are like, oh my god, Hunger Games, I have to get it. But I actually really like this color from the Hunger Games China Glaze collection. And so it's actually the color I'm wearing right now. And it's in the color Fast Track, which I don't know what that has to do with the Hunger Games. I mean, I don't know. But it's this gorgeous color. And I don't know if you guys are going to get the full effect of this. But it's so pretty. It's like a nude brown when you look at it. And then if you hold it in a certain light... It turns into like a bronze with like really pretty gold shimmers. It's such a unique color and I didn't have anything like this so I really wanted to get this. And then also from China Glaze, I got this flip flop, flip flop fantasy. And I have a color, I believe it's like shocking pink or something. It's like a neon pink from China Glaze. But this has more of a coral tone to it. And I love these bright colors like on my toes, especially for spring and summer. So I like this one a lot more than like the shocking pink. I think that's what it's called. Um, but I love, love, love this one. And then the last one I got from China Glaze is this peachy keen color. And it's a really like, it's kind of like, uh, what's that stuff called? stuff you eat, not ice cream. 
Sherbert, that's what it is. So it kind of reminds me of Sherbert, and it's just, it's not like a crazy out there orange. It's a very muted orange that's great for spring. It's not too bright, and it's just really, really pretty. And then the last color I got is from Revlon, and this is in the color Vintage. It's not really spring, it's more of like a fall color, but I don't really care. It's like this, like a burgundy, kind of pinkish purple dark color. It looks really, really pretty on. Okay, so if the lighting's a little, a little, a little, <laughs> a little different, I'm sorry. I had to literally, my mom was like, Courtney, you gotta go get blood work. So I ran out the door, and now I got a cool thing on my arm, but I'm gonna finish this now. So anyways, from Forever 21, I got these crazy mustard high-waisted shorts. I don't know really what I was thinking. Um, I guess it would look cute with like a white t-shirt or something. But I don't really like the material that it's made out of, but this is what they look like. They weren't expensive though, they were like $11. Just like that. I think they just need to be ironed and it would help a lot. I got this shirt to go with it, but I don't really like it together. But it's a cute shirt nonetheless, and it was only $4.80. So it's just this white and peach striped tank top, just like a razor back, very simple. This shirt, I love it. It's like a see-through kind of tank top and obviously you wear something under it, but um, well, you know, maybe not. Maybe, maybe that's a thing. But anyways, um, I really like it just because the stripes are vertical and not horizontal. I think it's really different. It's kind of like a referee shirt. I don't know. And then I got this shirt. They also had a lot of colors like this, but I'm loving coral lately. And this is one of the shirts this style is in right now. It's like sleeveless, but it has like a collar and it buttons down. It's super cute. I love the way this looks. These last two things, um, not too sure about. Pastel pants are hugely in right, huge, hugely in right now, and so I wanted to either get a pair like this or like a coral color, and so I got this, and I'm normally a size 27 from Forever 21. I have a pair of their jeans, and they fit great, and these are 27, and they do not fit me well at all. Um, I don't think I could really return them just because it costs more for shipping than to keep it, because they're like... 11 or 15 dollars because I don't have a forever 21 near me so I always order online usually but these are just like baggy they just don't fit nicely they don't I don't know maybe I can make something work with these things but I don't, I don't really like them and this last thing I actually spent kind of a lot of money on it was 17 dollars for forever 21 I mean it's not it's a lot to me okay guys and it's a high low skirt maybe I'll do a video on how to wear this and I'm not so sure how I feel about high-low skirts because this is, this is the first one I tried and I'm not very tall so that's why I feel like I have to wear heels when I wear this. The color though, I like the color online and I saw like another beauty guru get this color and I was like that's really pretty and then it kind of makes me feel like a salsa dancer and the light's like shining on my eyes. But it's just like this maroon red kind of color. But it's really, really long in the back. It makes me feel like I'm on Dancing with the Stars almost. The back is just so long, so much longer. I know it's supposed to be like that, but it's just really, really long. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll do a video how to wear a high-low skirt. If you want to see that, let me know. And the last thing I got is this shirt I'm wearing. Again, it's black, but I got it to actually go with, like, this shirt or just whichever. And this shirt's actually kind of long, but it's super cute. Let me stand up, see if you guys can see that. Um, it's see-through, and then it has like different patterns along it. Tell me if you want to see those kind of lookbooks videos for the things I mentioned. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Mwah.